Good morning guys, I hope you're all well. Today I thought I would do a chatty morning get ready with me. We're heading out today to a movie premiere, which makes it sound really posh. We're going to a preview screening of Dora the Explorer. It's nothing fancy, um, but the boys are downstairs drawing, although I think I can hear one of them coming up. And I'm gonna put some makeup on today. Normally I go makeup free, but halfway through the summer holidays, I'm starting to feel like I need just a little bit of makeup to get me through the day. So yeah, I thought I'd do a little chatty morning get ready with me and we can have a bit of a catch up because I've not really been filming much. Summer holidays have just kicked my butt. I feel like I've not had time to sit down and film. The house is a mess, so later on I'm gonna try and film like a cleaning video and a minimizing one because it seems to be clutter everywhere. Let me know that I'm not the only one going crazy. I used to always see memes of mums like, first day of the summer holidays and they look really like put together and then halfway through and they're like dragging their feet a bit and then by the end of the summer holidays they're just like on the floor with a bottle of wine um and I understand it now <laughs> okay so anyway all of my products that I use in today's video are from Tropic Skincare um as a disclaimer I'm a Tropic Skincare ambassador so I'll leave links below to all of the products and those links will take you to my web shop so anything that you buy from my web shop of course I get a commission from um, so if you've got any questions at all about anything Tropic, then the best thing to do is to follow me on Instagram, which is Tropic by Jessica AV. And yeah, I can give you lots of advice. We can talk about your skincare needs. We also do makeup, which is what I'm going to use today. Um, hair care, body products and stuff like that. And it's all vegan, cruelty free, natural. There's no toxins, no nasties. It's lovely. Okay, I'm going to get started. So... In the mornings, I don't tend to cleanse my face because I do that in the evening. So in the evening, I do my full on like cleanse tone, moisturize, serums, and all of that. In the morning, unless I've like particularly sweated at night time, I don't need to cleanse again. So I just splash my face with cold water, which is what I've done. And then I give my face a spritz with my vitamin toner. So this is a pore refining mist. It has got organic aloe vera juice, vitamin C and cranberry extract, and it's just really nice and refreshing and hydrating. It's lovely to do by like an open window. So I've done that, I've just given myself a few pumps. I started filming it, the boys started kicking off downstairs, so I've just started filming again, which is why I'm not gonna redo it. And then I applied a pea-sized amount of my Skin Feast moisturizer. So this is a nourishing cream concentrate made with hyaluronic acid, ectoin molecules, and kakadu plum extract, kakadu. Um, so it's just a really nice lightweight daily moisturizer. So it's great to use as like a base before you put your makeup on. That's all I've done this morning. Water, toner, moisturizer. And um, it's gonna keep going blurry. One of the kids is about to come in. That's tea. The tea. Yeah, tea bags. Yeah, tea bags. Okay, so I've got my little makeup thing here. And I am going to use my Tropic Hello Beauty Booster Sheer Foundation in Warm Beige. In. Yes, you can. Um, so this is really nice. It's a really lightweight foundation. It's not a thick one, um, but it's got SPF 35, which is amazing. So this is a really good one to use all year round. I'm just gonna pop a bit on the back of my hand. Are you excited to go to the cinema today, Baba? He's yes. here. <laughs> and I'm not going to see I've got my little beauty sponge, beauty blender, which again is from Tropic. I want to go to the blind store. And spritz it with the toner. Normally, sorry, am I getting you wet? I would okay. soak it in water because I tried using it dry before and it just soaks in the makeup, doesn't it? I learned the hard way. And this is the first time that I've used my toner for it because I thought I can't be bothered to go over to the sink and leave you guys. So we'll see how this goes. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. Oh, it's so what is this? I probably could have done with not doing as many squirts. That is my colour palette. And what is this? That is a mirror. And what is this? My phone. So yeah, today we're going to see Dora the Explorer at the cinema, which would be lovely. And then tomorrow, it's, whose birthday is it tomorrow, gents? Mine. Jensen's birthday and he turns three. Yeah. Which is very exciting. And we were going to go to P-E-P-P-A, P-I-G World. Um, but the weather's meant to be awful. No, 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 don't do that, but that's my camera lens. Um, so I don't know what we're going to do now. 
because then I thought, oh, well, we'll just go Thursday, but now their dad is coming back. He's, uh, he's coming back tomorrow, so he wants to have them for a little bit Wednesday, all of Thursday, and a little bit Friday. But Thursday's the day that I wanted to take them, but obviously he lives in Jamaica, so like I can take them any day. And then I'm going to use the Illuma, it's like an illuminating cream, like under eye cream, um, and doubles up as a concealer. So I'm gonna use it under here. I really hope this isn't blowing it's too loud. much. It's loud, finish there. Really, I should be looking in the mirror, <laughs> just there, but then you guys won't be able to see me. And this is exactly why I'm not a beauty vlogger. Okay. Oh, I just wish I could see in the mirror right yeah, now. This is on soap. Yeah. And I'm gonna have to look. Hang on. This is sauce. This is so sweet. It is, yeah, it's from Auntie Heidi. So I tend to just put it around my nose here because that's where I get like little veins, veins like really, really light veins. Um, under my eyes because kids, summer holidays, dark circles. Um, on top of my eyelids as well. And then, yeah, on any blemishes. Right, so I'm now going to use the colour palette, which is actually a really cool, cool product. Um, so I always find with palettes, there's always at least one thing that you don't use, like something's always wasted. But with this, it is completely customisable, refillable. So basically you choose which trays you want in there, which products. So all of them have to have one large, but then you could have three mediums, you could have one medium and four small, you could have six small, like there's all different combinations that you could go for. Um, and they're all removable, they're like magnetised out like this. And then these are refillable. So once you've run out of this, you can just buy the tray that pops into here or if you just want to change it you can have like a few of these at home and then just kind of ooh, swap them out like depending if you're going out and you want your nighttime look or if you're out, out for the day and you want your daytime look um so yeah it's great for the environment it's great for your pocket as well um like money wise and yeah you can customize it to have your own look so i am going to use the blush here I'm going to use the mirror. The brush is a tropic as well. I'm going to use the cream highlighter just here. This is like as fancy as I get. I'm going to pop a little bit of that on my brow bone. I'm going to pop a tiny bit. On the top of my lip, I don't know why I heard that that's quite a good trick to use. Um, and then just on my cheekbone as well. And then I'm going to use the eyebrow brush. Just to brush them up, make them all neat. And then I've got a brow powder here just to fill in I had the microbladed a while ago um, a really terrible job actually <laughs> the first time I had them done was amazing the second time I went elsewhere and it was um, pretty horrendous so I kind of I did all the aftercare that you're not supposed to do and let them fade very very quickly um, I don't think I ever really spoke about it on here uh, yeah, it was pretty. It was. It was really. It was really bad. I just thought like my face had been ruined, but luckily, it all faded. I'm gonna wear lipstick today. Normally, I would just use lip balm. I don't know what shade to go for. So we have got guava berry and fresh fig. I'm gonna. Go for, I'm gonna go for guava berry. Why not? Dora the Explorer. Get tropical. It's quite bold, isn't it? I like wearing lipstick. Some days I literally don't do anything to my face at all. And if I'm going on the school run, I just put sunglasses on and lipstick and I just feel like a million bucks. Okay, and then I'm gonna do my mascara. So this is the Lash Extension Kit from Tropic, which is pretty amazing. So the fixing gel can be used on its own as a mascara, or you can put the nylon fibers over it 
to create little mini extensions and then another layer of fixing gel to set it. Okay, so that's the fixing gel on its own. So you can see like there is a pretty good difference. And then I'm gonna apply the nylon fibers. I've got really long bottom lashes. <laughs> And they always touch my cheeks. Okay, so then I'm going to leave that one to set and go back in and apply the fixing gel to the other eye. And then back in with the fixing gel just to go over the nylon fibres to set them in. A little curl here. Not even a curl. A little sideburn. Mummy. Yeah? We have to... Mummy, we have to take a picture of our artwork. Yeah? Okay. And then we... Then we put it... Um, art tub for kids so they can see it. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, they said that. Can I see your picture? Ah, <gasps> that's so good! Right, so Jasper does this thing called Art Hub for Kids. Yeah, How good they, that is. Yeah, and they didn't colour it in. It's um, a, be careful coming behind me because you're naked. So it's a YouTube channel called Art Hub for Kids, so it's free. Um, and they show you step by step how to draw things, and it's a man that does it with his son and sometimes his daughter um, and just has learned to draw so much from it it's really really good okay so that is the makeup look now i need to do my hair so i'm currently doing the curly girl method let me move back a little bit but yeah i'm doing the curly girl method so basically i'm trying to get back my natural curls i haven't straightened blow dried curled for like i want to say two months now i use sulfate silicone free products, which are my Tropic products. Um, I use a microfiber towel now. And um, yeah, this is kind of probably the day before wash day. So you can see it's still quite curly underneath, but the top just drops and loses the curls. So I'm gonna have to wet it and put some product in, I think. Let's go do that. Okay, so I've switched camera lens so I can give you guys a a wider view. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wet my hair. Probably should have done this before putting makeup on. But yeah, you can also see my makeup look-ish. I'll show you guys probably in a bit. Um, okay, so I'm literally just running the tap and I'm going to wet my hair. I hope this is an interesting video. <laughs> Felt like a good idea at the time. Okay, so that is it all wet. So I'm going to give it a good scrunch to try and get those curls back. And then I'm going to use my Buclem Curl Defining Gel, which is, again, sulfate silicone, paraben free. And I'll leave a link to that below. It's obviously not a tropic one. Um, so I just put a generous amount in my hands. And then I just do a bit of praying hands, a bit of scrunching. I'm very new to the curly girl method and all of the terminology. Um, I'm going to use some more I think. Apparently the key is more product. So I'll flip it over this way and do this side. See this is just a rough, like this isn't a wash day routine or anything. Give it all a bit of a scrunch. And I didn't go close to the root because I didn't want to get my face wet after doing my makeup. So that is that. I'm going to clip it up while it dries just so it's not all wet on me. 
and choose something to wear. Okay, I think I'm just gonna go for, this all needs like a proper organize. Um, I think I'm gonna go for some mum jeans, ripped mum jeans. And then this pretty little top, which I need to give an iron. Um, yeah, nice and casual, and then I'll just wear it with some sandals. Okay, so this is my outfit. It's just really nice and comfy. Let's see what my hair's looking like. It's still a little bit damp. So that is my makeup look. Um, not an everyday makeup look because I just, I don't know how people wear makeup every day. I just don't, obviously I do have the time for it. I just don't want to make the time for it. Um, but when I do my makeup, I do feel very nice. And I feel like when I've got a good skincare routine, my makeup goes on nicely. Um, obviously throughout the day, the lipstick will wear away, but it does leave a really nice amount of color. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna let my hair dry naturally while we're out because it's got the product in it will just dry curly hopefully but yeah we're gonna get ready to go see Dora the Explorer now <laughs> okay apparently we're not but um yeah thank you very much well, thank you very much for watching I hope you liked this video if you did please do give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and keep an eye out for my posts on YouTube because my comments aren't working I've been doing lots of posts on there like different polls and questions and stuff because then it's my way of feeling like I can still